It was an early morning sweep. Officers boarded a passenger train from Churchill looking for anything out of the ordinary. Suspicious? Despite ongoing efforts, there's been no trace of Cam McLeod or Briar Schmigelski. Or if new evidence has surfaced, it's not yet been shared with the public. The duo has been on the run since last week when three bodies turned up in northern B.C. The men are wanted in the deaths of Lucas Fowler, China Deese and Leonard Dick. Heavily armed and skilled officers are on the ground working this investigation. And then there's the military. With the arrival of this Hercules, more ground can be covered and crews can get a detailed look around lakes, swamps and bush. A second military aircraft also landed in the region, a CP-140. It has high-powered cameras on board. The search area is huge, hundreds of kilometers in all directions around Gillum. The terrain is challenging, and so is the weather. When we talk about the ground search being conducted by members of the RCMP, they are paying particular attention to paths like this. We're not far from Gillum itself, and you can tell that it is quite a wooded area. But there are paths that have been created throughout this region, particularly for the hydro lines. So that's one of the areas that they're paying attention to, hydro line cuts as well as rail lines. The RCMP is still working under the premise that the pair is hiding out somewhere in the wilderness around Gillum. It's the last place they were seen, but that was nearly a week ago. The RCMP Major Crimes Division is following up on tips coming in from across Canada. While this is the epicenter of the search, RCMP officials say the investigation is being worked by officers right across the country. Crystal Gamansing, Global News, Gillum, Manitoba.